Hello and welcome everyone to Quick Album Reviews. I am the Bloodthirsty CJ Middle and today I'm slaughtering and drinking the blood of Bloodthirst by Cannibal Corpse. I recently just realized I never made a Cannibal Corpse review yet, so I randomly chose this album and uh, yeah, here we are. Just a quick side note, I'm not a huge fan of Cannibal Corpse. I enjoy most of their songs, but... They're not my go-to death metal band, so uh, just keep that in mind. Released in 1999, a year before Y2K, Bloodthirst is considered by some to be an underrated album amongst the entire Cannibal Corpse discography. I, on the other hand, would have to disagree. There is a reason this album doesn't pop up on many people's playlists, and uh, I'll tell you why that is. This album is a, well, I wouldn't say is a, but rather felt like a cookie cutter death metal album. Each track follows a similar, though I would not say identical, composition, which consists of opening riff, chorus, guitar solo, end. Roughly in that order. Of course, not every single track is like that, but enough of them are for me to point out. Nobody likes repetitive death metal. Unless you're that one guy who is super high and gets hypnotized by the same fucking repetitive beat. Another thing I want to point out on this album is Corpse Grinder's presence on here. He basically dominates this album. His vocals are the driving force that keeps everything moving along. While I do enjoy his growls and screams, I don't know if I like this vocal-driven version of Cannibal Corpse. It comes across as very strange and different to me because I'm so used to each member of the band contributing like their fair share. No one really dominates the sound in Cannibal Corpse, but on this album, basically Corpse Grinder is like the real like ass kicker on this album, which is a good thing for, I guess, some people if you want a more vocal driven cannibal corpse but for me i'm not really about just the one guy basically doing everything however what the album does have going for it though is the brutality it is fairly brutal and i thought it almost bordered on brutal death metal which i wasn't expecting it is more technical and obviously better produced than the average death metal band so at least there's that too, I guess. While I wouldn't say this album was boring, it was rather bland. Nothing really special or that memorable happens. I mean, if you want a straightforward version of uh, Cannibal Corpse, then I guess this is the album for you to check out. But for me, this album is pretty meh. It's okay, but does not even come close to some of their better albums, so... Yeah, that's all I got to say about that. And uh, yeah, that's all I got for today's review. Don't forget to like and subscribe and make sure you tell a friend to do the same. And I'll see you at the next review.